Hi Scorpio, welcome to your reading and <clears throat> this is your August the 17th and August the 18th of 2020. This is for Scorpio Ascendant, Moon rising and Venus placement on their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. So cross watchers, if I describe someone here and you know that it is not you, it is not you. For those of you who's new to the channel, you might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming and you can ask me question on the live stream. If you're going to join the live streaming, patience is needed. I am not skipping questions. I am answering questions in random. Um, yep, questions are popping up. I don't have the luxury to navigate the um the chat rooms i am uh, my, my my hands are busy um shuffling the cards so scorpio if you are impatient and um you'll just create drama uh stating um i am skipping your question instead of typing your question i'm not recommending you to join the live streaming or if you feel privileged that i need to answer your question the moment that you type in your um your question no I I'm not recommending you to join the live streaming there's a link in the description box click that link you will be routed to my page type in your question and then click submit okay for your, also you want to know your lucky number and lucky color Scorpio there's a link in the description box click that link you will be routed to my page type in your question and then click submit Scorpio um, 500 likes for this video you made it you gave me 700 the last time you had a taste of full reading 500 likes for this video your next video will be a full reading so scorpio if you resonate with the reading congratulations if you do not resonate with the reading um, come back to the reading after a week or two time is fluid if you resonate with some, the, some bits and pieces of the reading then still congratulations for i am doing a collective reading scorpio let's begin Scorpio, Nine of Pentacles in Reverse, wow, um, and the Ace of Cups, okay, you are in a situation where in, it felt like you're giving your cup of love to someone, but in this connection, you know that you're not happy anymore and that is the thing here that you're giving yourself it's not that you are forced to do it you are still hoping for this person to give you the cup of love that you need but this person is kind of like giving you less of what you deserve giving you um things that breaks you uh, but you're still willing to do it and this is a rare for a Scorpio um, the chariot is here so there are separations there's already a separation for a few more numbers of you um, this person whom you connected to or this is you it's just sitting on your throne not doing anything it's kind of like missing the other person you might be connecting with a cancer or has a cancer placement on their chart or you have a cancer placement on your chart or an Aries or has an Aries placement on their chart or you have an Aries placement on your chart. I can see here that there is really a separation between you both. It could be physically or metaphorically as I can see that someone is missing the other person. It could be you cross watchers. It could be you. Um, Scorpio cross watchers if you feel like this is your reading so be it and Scorpio if you feel like you are on the cross watcher side that is okay I am not reading which side you at I am reading the energy but one thing's for sure someone here is hurting on the higher font you might also be connecting with a Taurus or has a Taurus placement on their chart or you have a Taurus placement on your chart um, someone here who is hurting who is suffering 
couples are trying to give everything that they can for the other person even though that the return is not in their favor they wanted this connection to come to flourishing they wanted this person to get involved in this relationship it's kind of like I'm feeling that someone is pleading um, almost energetically I can also see that um, Father of Pentacles, the person is willing to give it all, like to give it all. I can feel the sadness on this person because um, low-key, it's kind of like, please, can you give attention? Can you give it a one more try? Um, give it a one more chance. But low-key, right? Low-key. You're not saying it verbally, but the energy feels like it. You're really manifesting this person. Um, something will change in this person's um, point of view from this separation. Wheel of Fortune is going to happen. So this is kind of like a push in the universe that your person is going to do something that will be in your favor. Communication here is about to happen. Scorpio communication is about to happen. This is a truthful con communication. Well, your person might be, let's say, um, exploring with other people, but as I can see here from those exploration, from those people that they're gonna meet, they will be enlightened here. It's, it feels like you will be, they will compare you and nothing can, co and no one can compare to you. Um, you're gonna outshine the other, per, uh, other people here. But what I want to know is why this nine of pentacles is in reverse. Okay, um, here you are, page of uh, pentacles. You really wanted to give something to the person. Um, even it, it felt like even your own love. You're putting your person in, you know, in a priority list um, more than yourself. And let's see here more why it is in reverse. This is probably your strategy to, you know, make your person love you. But there is something off with that strategy. Um, Scorpio, I would like to suggest to put yourself first because, again, if, you know, if your friends, let's just use friends as an example. If your friends needed you, 100% you are there, right? But if yourself needed you, you're doubting it. Okay? You might be laying back and, you know, commit to yourself, please. Okay, Scorpio? But let's see here. What more? Um, this Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands is actually a repeat card here. Yes, a communication for a commitment because they don't want to end this connection. Something will happen here. They also, at one point in time, they probably turn their back in this connection or pause this connection but as I can see they're gonna learn or they're gonna find out that they don't also want this connection to end um, this is your reading Scorpio if you're resonant with this and you want to go in depth you can book a personal reading with me you can contact me if you're okay with the reading and you have a question or two there's a link in the description box. Click that link. You'll be routed to my page. Tap in your question. Click submit. Scorpio, this is your reading. 500 likes for this video. Your next video will be a full reading once again. Click the subscribe button. Smash that notification bell. Comment down below. I'm very interactive. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you in the next reading. Goodbye. You are the best of my heart. You just